Hello everybody, it is I, Ugubuga3, the spectacular, the one, the only, and I'm bringing you episode 7 of my Dragon Warrior 7 Let's Play. That's two sevens, which means it's almost like really lucky. So, yep. And so, I just beat the living hell out of Matilda, and like curb stomped her and everything, and so, ah, uh, what a good day it is. And I uh, am returning to Rexwood. Oh, it's a person. Hank, you've returned safely. My husband told me everything. You rescued us from the monsters. Thank you so much. It's too bad I don't remember anything after we were taken away. You, human. Hank, my woman's back in the sky's blue again. We're going to start rebuilding the town tomorrow. Man, I can't wait. Whenever a mighty oak follows, a small sapling comes to take its place. Life is filled with such cycles. Pretty wise. Hmm. Alrighty. Actually, first, I want to revive myself because I don't think I can do that back home. Is that a bunny? There's a bunny here. What does she say? Oh, I'm so happy. Do you really feel that way? Oh, at last. I can't stand to be away from you ever again. Not even for a second. Would you like to marry me? Or I could tell the whole village. Okie dokies. Going back to the church. Do my eyes deceive me? The darkened sky has finally returned to its original cerulean splendor. May God bless Hank and Kiefer in all of their adventures. Now then. Courageous servants of God, what do you seek in our temple? Hi, I'm gonna revive. Would you like to call back? I would like to call back Uzi. Do you wish to donate 20 gold to the Shumpa? Sure. Oh, how powerful are no, Cad. Bring back, I suppose, your faithful servant. Yay. Oogsipoo is revived. Would you like anything else? Nope. Actually, I'd like to save. Very well. Confess before God what has happened. Save your adventure journal. Yep. Memory card slot one. Checking memory card. Uh, blah, blah, blah. Save my two. Uh, uh, so I'll invite Oogsipoo to level two. Continue. Yeah, 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 yeah. Alrighty. Save complete. Continue adventuring. Yes. Hey, I wonder if he said Kiefer because Kiefer was the leader, or if he actually meant that. Uh, nope. Never mind. He's not gonna talk about that again. Curses. Foiled again. I will never know if he was going if he said Kiefer because I was dead, and he would originally say Ugzipu, or if he just was always gonna say Kiefer. Ugh. My life has been a lie! Yo, Patrick. Faja, you are back. And you are not bleeding profusely this time. I'm sorry, I worried you, son. But now we'll never have to worry about monsters again. Have you seen Matilda? I want to hear the good news, too. Matilda? Yeah, we saw her. Don't worry, I thanked her for you like you told me to. Yippee, so what kind of trophy did you bring me? What's this, the bowels of a cat mage? Jeez, and I thought they smelled bad on the outside. Heh <laughs> heh. That's disgusting. Ah, uh, the bowels of a cat mage. Anyways, there's no point in standing around here. Let's go inside. The darkness has lifted, and the women have all returned. Everything is back to normal. So what is this sadness I feel now? I just wish that Re Rex's younger sister could have seen the peace we have regained. Well, I can't waste your time with my small talk forever. Rex's sister told you to go to the forest where she met you. Perhaps there is a clue that will help you back to your kingdom. However, if you don't find anything, I will be waiting. You have always have a home to... You always have a home here, and I promise to protect you, Oogsipoo. I shall never forget what I owe you for saving my life. I miss you. But above that, I pray for your safe return to your kingdom. Continue to fight the good fight. Farewell, Oogsipoo. This text is so hard to read. Ah, whatever. No matter. At least I can read. <laughs> uh. You can't handle the flowers. You think that these flowers are for you? They are not. Eh. I say, Poe, take a look. The flowers only bloom in this area. It's too bad. I want to show Matilda as well, but I wonder where she is. Will you hand over the wood doll? Yep. 
What? Matilda says this was for me? Thank you, Uxapoo. I will take good care of it and cherish it always. Uh, what an evil little turd. Should Spartan kick him into a pit. Unworthy. Alrighty then. I wonder what would be here. Nothing. <laughs> uh, it's a portal! And that, my friends, is how I got teleported home. Through light speed. Warp speed, rather. Back in the temple. This place looks strangely familiar. It looks as if we've returned. As soon as we fit the shards under the pedestal, they formed what looked like a map, and then we... But wait, just where was that place? Was it all just a dream? Just how dense are you, Kiefer? That was no dream. How could all of us have the same exact dream? I'm not too sure what it was, but I do know that I was put in immense danger because of our bumbling oafs. Huh? Stop your daydreaming, Oogsie Poo. Don't you see the gravity of the situation? <laughs> no. Hump. Dense as usual. Regardless of what just happened, at least I made it back safely. I even had a little fun, as much as I hate to admit it. Anyhow, I should return to my home before I incur my mother's wrath. Count me in. Damn, my dad's gonna be mad again. I'll contact, I'll contact you soon. Soon! How rude, he didn't even say goodbye to me. Let's go home, Oopsie Poo. Yay. Yay! I gotta go home. Uh, and the game will actually be get fun after this. <laughs> Believe it or not. Yeah. So yeah, I'll get it fun around episode 8 or 9. Eh. Interesting, considering this is like episode 6. What is it? I think it's 6. No, is it 7? 6 or 7? I think it's 7. Yeah, it's 7. I remember 7 because I made a pun. Ha! Huh. Yay! Puns are good. See? I always make puns. They help with memory, of course. Ah. Hello, little obese chicken pigs. This is such a long walk back. Such a long walk. We left! And then I go, whoop! And then I go up again, and then I go left again, and then I go up again, and then I go right, and then I go down, and then I go right, and then I go right, <sighs> and then I go up, 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 and then I go down, and then I'll go left a little bit, and then I go down, and then I am finally, 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 finally back at my beautiful little island. Da 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 da. We finally come back. I'm so tired. I have to go get some sleep. See you later, Oopsie Poo. This is Fishbell, small village surrounded by the sea. Oh, Uxie Poo, Prince Kiefer and Maribel were with you too, right? Everyone was worried because we hadn't seen you three. That's not the case at all today, though. Everyone's really excited about the new island that suddenly appeared. New island suddenly appearing? What? Meow! Roar, meow! And see, I see, I see! Indeed, indeed. The cats have made... Have, have, have just told me everything and all makes sense now. Oopsie Poo, where in the world have you been? Everyone was worried. Prince Kiefer and Maribel disappeared too. Well, you promised me that you won't scare anybody like that again? She yes, didn't know. Oh dear, this isn't the time for that. Have you heard? There's a rumor going around that a new island has been discovered near this one. That's why your father and Amit went to the castle. Can it really be true? I just can't believe it. I can't believe it either. It's almost as if there's some sort of mysterious conspiracy going on here. I better get to the bottom of this, me and my floppy hat. Uh. Hey, old man. It's a new island. I wonder what kind of people are living on it, or maybe it's uninhabited. Whatever the case may be, it sure is exciting. Yo! Welcome to East Start Castle. There is a very important meeting right now. I'm sorry, but please come back later. What? Hello, hello, Oxypoo. As you come all this way, I regret to inform you that His Highness has given the most unusual command that the castle gates be closed. If you are looking for the prince, he departed the castle a little while ago, saying that he was going to see his grandfather. Oh, ho! 
I know what that means. It's the old fart. Ah. Uh. <sighs> Hello, Kifi Poo. Ha ha, I figured you would come about now, Oopsie Poo. I'm certain you've heard that the new island and the expedition team that's been formed. Even that old man was summoned to the castle. But did they bother to involve us? No! I wasn't even selected for that expedition team. I can't believe it! I think it's about time we used our little secret weapon. I'm going on ahead to Fishbell, so I'll meet you there later. So long, Oogsie Poo. We'll need to meet up in the cave on the shoreline in Fishbell. Will you show up? Yep. Very well. Yep, yep, yep. Ah, uh, the door is locked. Now, time to go to that mysterious cave in Fishbell. Ah. Uh. To the mysterious cave. Ooh, I'm so excited for the game that's about to get fun. I feel all tingly inside. Ooh. Down into the fish bell. Alrighty. Right, and then down, and then left, and then down. Then left, and then down, and then left, and then down, and then down, and then left, and then left, and then down, and then down, and then left, and then left, and then up, and then left, and then right! Yay! Uh, Mirabelle's here. What the hell? Ha, so my intuition was correct. Eh. Why would Mirabel be here? Ha, I can read you like a book. Hmm. Oh well, never mind. Let's get going, Oogsie Poo. We'll just have to lift the lid ourselves. Wait, I'll help out too. Gold! Come on. Come on. What the hell? There we go. Exipu and his friends moved the stone lid. That was so much harder than it should have been. All this just to hide a staircase? Oh well, let's hurry down. And then we go left, and then we go up, and then we go left, and then we go up. Oh, look, I know it's a shop! This way, this way. Hey, wait up! What happened to the boat? Ta da! What do you think? This old bucket is finally all fixed up. It took us a few years, but it's ready to go. Let's climb aboard. Come in here, Bill. Is this my family's old boat? Papa said it was decommissioned because it was too unstable. Are you ready to go, Oogsipoo? Yep. Alright, raise anchor. Onward to the new lands. You were going to leave me behind, you jacks. I guess I should hardly expect more from a couple of morons who can't tell an island from a continent. Oh, right, right. Anyway, full speed ahead. <laughs> yeah, finally, I got your boat. I'm on a boat. Come on. There we go. Way. Let's see. Item. Use. Huh. It's an island directly above ours. I hadn't checked the world map before. So, didn't. What's it aware? That cave looks familiar. Wait, could it possibly be? Oh. What? What? Oh, a group of travelers. This is Rexwood. Ho, ho, ho. The village at the upper center of the forest. Please enjoy your stay. You came here across the sea? Wow, you're a brave soul. What? There isn't supposed to be an island here? You're not seasick, are you? Silent's been here for eons, so I suppose education is surely lacking in the land from where you came. You came from Estart? I know the name, but I've never been there myself. 
Maybe I'll try heading there for my next stop. This is a weapon and armor shop. How might I help you? I like to buy something. Oh, wow. it's pretty cool. They've got better stuff than last time. Come again. Hmm. I wonder if they ever got around to building that grand church. Oh, and they did! Huff, huff. Cleaning up around the temple is such a bother. South of here, there's a mine where you can find some gems called color stones. They're very fragile, but their vibrant co colors make them quite valuable. Let's see. There you are. The hiding hole's still here. No, it isn't. Actually, it's been destroyed to make that farm. This is a totally different building. Actually. Nothing on there. Disappointing. Cool, I got 25 gold. Meow. That was a disappointed meow from a disappointed cat. Something fishy must be going on here. Well, anywho, I'll go to a uh, Patrick's original house, which is not here. Right there. Was it? I come from a long line of warriors that have vowed in blood to protect the, to protected, to protect it, to protect this village for years. Of course, when life's this peaceful, there's not much for me to do. Have you noticed the viewing tower in the middle of the village yet? Back when the tower was completed, it was christened after a few of our ancestors. Although the name has fallen by the wayside, it's officially known as Hank's Tower. What? Do you hear what that woman said? Oogsie poo, what's going on here? This surely is Rexwood, isn't it? Ooh, too much thought involved. This is making my head hurt. Time to go up in the tower. Oh, old guy. I'm looking at... I like looking at my reflection in the water. It makes me feel alive somehow. Oh, depressed old man. Yeah. Long ago, this village was twice taken by monsters. The second time, they raped us of our women. Even the blue was stolen from the sky. Then a brave man defeated the monsters and saved the villagers, so they say. Ending a crisis is the one's own two hands. That's what this village was built on. Oh, it's pretty snazzy. Of course, it wasn't noted that four people did it. No, it was just Hank. Not Hank, Oogsie Poo, Kiefer, and Maribel. Even though Maribel did too much. She's, like, the worst character ever invented. Anywho, this building here. It may be peaceful on land, but I hear there are, heard there are monsters still living in the ocean. What, you cross the sea to come here? Oh my! Most people here are too afraid of the sea to even go near it. Why is this village called Rexwood? Well, that's an odd question to ask. I certainly don't know, and I, if I don't know, then I doubt anyone else does either. Ooh, a shard. Hey, Xipu, that shard looks familiar. Do you think it could be something useful? Impossible. Could it be... The same as the one we used at the Fane to get here? I see you've noticed our little treasure. My husband brought me that stone to make up for all his hurtful lies and affairs. Much like my husband, it's just taking up space here. It's a painful reminder, so I was going to throw it out. Do you want it? Yes! Then continue it you then consider it yours. It's as worthless to me as my husband. There is one condition. I want you to tell my husband about this before you leave. He's by the pond right after you cross the bridge. Say hello to him for me, alright? Ozipu received the wind shard. Seems fishy. Okie dokie, to the old guy. Okie dokes, here we are. What? My wife sent you to say hello? Is that my stone? Oh jeez, hell hath no fury like a woman scorned. If you're interested in finding more precious stones, you should try the color stone mine. That's where I found that stone. There might be others laying around there still. Oh. Time to go to the mine. To the mine! A mine, they call it. Ah. <laughs> totally relevant, Lord of the Rings quote. Great, you found the agility seed. Kiefer obtained the agility seed. What do you want to do, Exipo? Do you want to go to the color stone mine? I didn't mean to talk to you because I already know what to do, but whatever. 
Defense Seed used on Oogzipu. Agility Seed used on Oogzipu. Righty-o. To the Colorstone Mine. Huh? You hear that there's a strange stone shard hidden here somewhere? Come to think of it, there was this guy a while back with the same story. Well, free to feel free to look around if you want, but don't get in anyone's way. Hey, SM guy. What's up? Work, work, work. I'm too busy to rest. Well, it's kind of disturbing considering the fact that this episode's already over. Once again, I'm Oogabooga 3 of Titanic Sloth, and I would like to thank you for wanting this be watching this beautiful video. And I would ask you to please comment, rate, subscribe, and perhaps do some various other nefarious deeds in my name. Not so nefarious that you get arrested and flogged, but kind of mildly nefarious. And on a scale of 1 to 10 on nefariousness, preferably a 4. Once again, thank you for watching. I'll catch you next time.